they were very, very poor against Sarsfield. There's no getting around it. They've bounced back as well. They got the job done against Limerick's Newcastle West, 10 points to seven. An experienced side there as well. A few positional uh, switches maybe in the team at the moment, but like they have to challenge themselves first to do this back-to-back Munster titles as well because they know themselves. What They play much better in Munster than they did in that Orange semi-final. Yeah, and like I would imagine there's a drive in them, Darren, to do the back-to-back, you know, because it would obviously be something, you know, a record that the club would love, you know, would love to have. Uh, you know, three tip titles in a row, back-to-back Munster titles, and maybe, you know, people would start to give them then due respect when they get out into the All-Ireland series. But they can't produce a performance like they did in the in the All Ireland semi final in the Munster final at the weekend, and then you know even if they were to come out do something similar, I I just think Drum and Inch have to step up now. Um, in 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 all jigs and reels here, it's going to be tough. You know, as you said, you you, you have a right Munster final between the last two uh, champions, and uh, you know like. It won't, it won't be easy for Drum and Inch. I don't think they've been fantastic either, Darren. I wonder, is there a little bit of a hangover? Newcastle West, if they'd taken some of their opportunities, it could have been an awful lot closer. You know, they're relying a lot of Ian McGrath, the place uh, taking there from her. Um, I just think they're lacking a little bit of life in the in, in, in the forward line, it would seem. Suffering to get goals, that seems to be another factor as well. And I think in this time of year, Darren, you get a goal in, in, in a Camogie match, especially in January, it, it's going to buy you an awful lot. And it, it, it definitely did for um, Scarif Agunlo against Inish Gara. So, you know, I, I think... Drum and Inch, they have an opportunity here. I just think they have the quality, Darren. I just wonder what's what's holding them back. You know, they'll turn around and they'll probably say, well, hold on here. Look, we played Newcastle West in tough conditions. It was physical. It was attritional. Um, They played to their game plan. They locked the game down then when Newcastle West came at them. I just, I, as I said, from reading reports and, and, and catching up on, on the stream that they, that they did, I just wasn't blown away by them. And I think, you know, if they're to be considered for All-Ireland honours, we're going to have to see a little bit more from them starting at the weekend. 